today we will perform an experiment the object is to determine the thickness of glass strip by using spherometer the apparatus which is required is spherometer glass strip and glass slab spherometer works on the principle of micrometer screw gauge so it can measure up to 100th of millimeter means 0.01 millimeter it has two scales circular scale and vertical scale which is also known as main scale the main scale is fixed while circular scale can rotate and it has three legs so to perform the experiment of to find the thickness of glass strip first of all we will check its zero error means we will coincide the zeros of main scale and circular scale if the zero of main scale coincides with the zero of circular scale then there will be no zero error how can we check that uh, there is no zero error we will take a page we will take a piece of paper and uh, place spherometer on glass glass slab when we pass the paper through the legs then it will not pass if it will not pass then there will be no zero error so we will now measure the thickness of the glass strip now we will place glass strip on the glass slab and then we will place spherometers like this so we will adjust its reading and uh, again we will check that the paper will not pass through the legs now paper is not passing through the legs so now we will take the reading the reading of vertical scale is obtained as 2 mm so we have written 2 mm as the reading of vertical scale and the reading of circular scale is obtained as 90 deviance means here 90 deviance coincides so the reading of circular scale is 90 deviance like this we will take at least 3 uh, readings then we will make calculations we will take an other reading by placing the glass strip like this and also check the papers why it is passing through legs or not now it is not passing through the legs so the reading of the reading of vertical scale will remain same means 2 mm 
the reading of circular scale changes so the reading of vertical scale is 2 mm and the reading of circular scale varies now it is obtained as how much 90 90 1 93 deviants now second re reading we have obtained is the circular scale reading 93 deviants and like this we will take third reading and also we will check that the paper is not passing through the legs of the spherometer the third reading is obtained is the vertical scale reading will remain same which is 2 mm but the circular scale reading changes now we have obtained 95 deviants so we will write 95 deviants now we will make calculations we have to find fractional part so fractional part kaise find karenge hum b ko number of deviants jo humne find kiye hain unko hum least count se multiply karwayenge least count jo hai spherometer ka that is 0.01 mm so for first reading b will be obtained as 90 into 0.01 it will be obtained as 0.9 and for second b will be 93 into 0.01 it will be equal to 0.93 and for third b will be equal to 95 into 0.01 it will be obtained as 0.95 now we will make its total so to obtain the total we will add the value of a and b so total will be equal to the a plus b so here a is 2 and b is obtained as 0.9 so t will be equal to 2.09 and for second reading t will be equal to means this is t1 and this is t2 so it will be equal to 2 plus 0.93 so t2 will be obtained as 2.93 and T3 will be obtained as 2 plus 0.95, so it will be 2.95. So now we will take its mean, mean reading. So the mean of total is T1 plus T2 plus T3 divided by 3. Here T1 is 2.9 plus T2 is 2.93 plus T3 is 2.95 divided by 3. So the mean of total is obtained as 2.92 millimeter. So the thickness of glass strip is obtained as 2.92 millimeters.